Ohio baseball returned to the red after sweeping Toledo in their last series, and their opponent in this Tuesday matchup, the Marshall Thundering Herd, a team on a four-game losing streak and looking to bounce back. After a scoreless first inning, Marshall got to starter Colin Sells, rattling off four runs before a Daniel Karanichi three-run homer to left gave the club a 7-0 lead in the top of the second. After the homer, Ohio manager Craig Moore decided to make a pitching change, and he brought in sophomore Tyler Peck. Peck was able to quickly get the Bobcats out of the inning. In the third inning, Ohio's bats began to chip away at Marshall's lead. After an Alec Patino double, Mason Minzy was able to drive him in for the squad's first run of the game. In the very next at bat, Will Sturk homered down the right field line to cut the herd's lead down to four. And that momentum carried into the fourth as the Bobcats were able to put up three more runs, first behind a Nick Dolan sacrifice fly, then another Patino double, and an RBI ground out for Minzy. Jumping ahead of the sixth inning, and Marshall was able to add on to their run total. Kyler Schaefer pulled a breaking pitch down the line for a solo home run and giving the herd an 8-6 lead. In the bottom half of the sixth, Marshall went to the bullpen and brought in junior Drew Harlow, and he was able to shut the Bobcats down. The right-hander pitched through the eighth, notching five strikeouts and only allowing one hit in his three innings of work. But with Harlow out of the game, Ohio did make a comeback attempt in the bottom of the ninth. After a hit by pitch and a walk, the winning run was at the plate. However, Cole Williams grounded out to end the game and give Marshall the 8-6 win. After the game, Coach Craig Moore acknowledged how much perseverance means to his team. Yeah, they're, they're not going to quit. You know, they're they're, they're going to play till the last out. You know, and no, no matter um, you know who we play, when we play, um, you know, no matter what the score is, no matter if we're up. 10 runs or for down 10 runs, we're going to continue to play to the very last out. And these guys understand that. And, and they've shown it, obviously, over a period of time that that's how we're going to, to, to play, that that's our culture of our program. Looking ahead, the Bobcats will have a weekend rivalry matchup against the Miami Redhawks. Ohio currently sits third in the MAC and are looking to improve their seating in this upcoming series. For Bobcat Showcase, I'm Parker Kapronica.